Alrighty, so I'll start off with our sleeping. <clears throat> got a little bit of a runny nose. I'm kind of glad I got all these hours of... Uh-oh, got panicked. All these hours of videos that we can watch while we are quarantined from the Black Plague. Uh, do I have any sleeping pills with me? That guy keeps waking up after five hours, though. It's kind of annoying. Well, I guess we'll just start the day. Um, and today... I have a shortage of wood glue, so I think I'm gonna make a run over to Muldra. And those... Uh, warehouses. To get some wood glue and maybe some thread. I need some thread too. Toilet paper! <laughs> yeah, all the people in my area are buying up toilet paper like panicked idiots. And I wonder if there's a book I could read to get rid of this anxiety. Not in here. food. I think I'm gonna run out of this vegetable stir-fry pretty soon. I'm gonna need some more of it. Now I'll need some more junk food. Fatty. Still getting fat. This will just start the day. Let's unset our alarm. Since it's so early. And I don't remember quite where I am in West Point, so I'm just gonna drive around for a bit. Until I figure it out. Curse of a million not choose is back. Seven blunts. And I got my trunk here. I got a bunch of baseball bats. However, I can't fit any of them in there. So, I guess we're putting these baseball bats back into the weapons cache. Very slowly. There we go. Let that zombie go. Disappeared. Must have went in that house. What the hell? You didn't throw your other bat in there? Is there no room? Yeah, it's full up. Oh, you know. There's the ground. Pull another spike baseball bat out of here. Because you always need to have a backup. Let's get on our way to Muldra. Yeah, there's gonna be all these assholes. Kalos, or whatever the fuck they're called. Not gonna bother killing all them again, just a waste of ammo. You know, I 
could just practice some zombie killing while I'm here. Get some more of these weapon trainings done. Charge! Huzzah! Spot any decent sized boards along the way, I think I'll probably stop and kill them. It's kind of cool, you can't even see the road really. With all the snow. It's still below freezing. Oops. Do not want to hit zombies. Fuck up this car. For those who use an actual scientific system for their temperature, 32 degrees Fahrenheit is the freezing point for water. Corresponds with zero C. Sports car there. It's all banged up though. I'll probably stop at the crossroads here. If there's enough zombies for it. It's a decent amount. Let's get to work. I do have a generator in the car. I could hook it up and use it at this gas station. I gotta see how much gas I have left. I need some fear pills. Fear is the mind killer. Brutal. And these are tough zombies too. Like I, I upped their hit points. It's that much of a badass, I guess. Womp. <laughs> I think they said in a recent release that they uh, added some more animations for the blunt. We'll see. Get any of them. There's a spiffles there. And in fact, I do need some more canned vegetables. Because I'm about to run out of them. it up. So far so good. Oh, so far so bad. It's an alarm on it. It's a bit outside, do some zombie slaying until the alarm turns off. Snow blind. Clear the 
other side of the building here. Look at this guy, he's all dressed up. What kind of zombies we got? Not too many. Thankfully. I bet a bunch of them got inside though. Be dangerous staying near these windows because they fucking knock you down all the time. Wonder if it'll set off the alarm again. One sneaking up behind me. Disengage from banging on shit to come after you now. That's kind of nice. It's before, once they start banging on something, they're just locked in. Yeah, I did say I wanted zombies, so this works out. out of me. Let's see some leather gloves on these. Seem to wear out pretty quickly, so... Uh, there's somebody down there shooting. I am not alone. Other than the zombies. This guy that was dressed up, is he an uh, actual military person or is he some dude? Some dude. Insulation wind resistance. Mine has. Mine has. <laughs> Where's my vest? Am I not wearing a vest? Where's my vest? Ah, oh, there it is. It's actually better than this one. Probably has a hole in it though. No, oh, well. That's what happens when you try to take clothes off the of zombies that you killed. You already beat the shit out of them in order to kill the zombie. Convenience store. Yeah, right, let's see if we can't loot this. Uh, 
they're not fully looted, but at least get some canned goods. I really don't want canned soup. Soup is not worth it. Canned potato. Check on who's whoever's over there. Let them spend some of their ammo on the zombies first. Oh, what the hell? I can see. Oh. Oh, maybe if it's like on the label, the calories. It's a lot of calories. Eat it. It's like I don't have the nutrition's perk. place is turning into kind of a bust. Usually a spithos is a lot better. There you go, potatoes. Where's the fridge? It's in here. There you go. Nice rotten bread. Tasty. Alright, well, got a couple cans out of it. Better than nothing. So now let's go see who is shooting over here. How is my bat doing? It's pretty beat up. Pick these guys off. You know, I never went clothes shopping, so maybe this. Maybe I'll find some clothes in here. Take a peek inside. I don't see anyone in here. They weren't in the clothes barn. I'm sweating. Maybe I need to lose a layer. Let's see how that does to my insulation. Doesn't really change it. So I got full insulation. Fine, we're doing this the hard way. Ooh. Zombie in here. Oh. Right in the face. Ah, this place is picked over. Really picked over. Well, maybe not really picked over. Polo neck sweater. Is that better than my V-neck sweater? Yes. I was just talking about losing layers, and now I'm adding more insulation. <laughs> well, we 
always a hoot. Baseball cap, t-shirt, yeah. Long sleeve t-shirt, I already got one of those. Jeans, lumberjack shirt, I'm not wearing a lumberjack shirt. Yeah. Baseball cap. Overalls. <laughs> it's actually not that bad. I think my military pants are better. Yellow, red, yellow. Green, yellow, red. Hmm. 10, 20. 10, 20. Maybe. Not fully convinced. Some more stuff in here. There's weapons in here. Just random supplies. It looks like it's just random supplies. Can I grab enough duct tape? There's some thread that I wanted. Oh yeah, I forgot you can loot clothing stores for thread. See if they got any of these things. Uh, these aren't lootable. Alright, let's get out of here. Somebody in the gas station, maybe? What's that car doing parked? Right where it is. So I learned my lesson about just blindly walking into gas stations. Even if they're... our friendly survivors. Let's get our gun out just in case. Seem to be anyone in there. You never know, they could just be in the back there. Let's keep that gun out. Some more gas cans. Mostly for canned goods, but I don't think canned goods even spawn in gas stations. So, let's just get out of here. Where was the person who was shooting? Maybe they're over there. Nolan, the friendly. There could be a hostile in there with him, though. <laughs> Learned this lesson the hard way. Keep moving. Yeah, this sweating would be more of a problem if I didn't take the outdoorsman trait. How much gas we got? Oh, plenty of gas, we don't need to refill. 
on the road again. Killing zombies on the road again. This bat is going to break any time now. Out of the woods there. Not that I'm complaining, I want zombies. Sweet. How's my bat doing? Or my blades? Yeah, long blunt skill. Getting pretty close to level 8. <laughs> if you miss the first swing, just always push. near the trailer park here, there's, there's probably going to be a decent amount of Zeds. So maybe I'll go accomplish my primary objective, which is getting wood glue. And then I'll kill all the zombies on the way back. I think that sounds like a plan. Come on. Avoid them. Oh man, look at that car. It's <laughs> a big group. You know, I said I was gonna kill them all on the way back, but I just cannot. Group is on the just gonna kill them all. There's no question about it. This bat has to be damn near broken. Resist the urge. Resist the urge. Keep going. I have a mission to complete. Well, these car blocks are a bit more of a problem when the side of the road's all. Um, I 
eroded up with the trees and stuff. your trunk. Ah, no. Feel the trunk capacity lowering. I do have an axe. I could have just chopped away through along the side. Kind of a waste of time, though. Preserve the car. That wasn't so bad though, there's only one roadblock on the way to Muldra. The warehouse should be right over here. Switch bats before I get to them. E level eight. All right, take your fear pills. Pull out your other bat. Okay, let's go to town. Hey, zombies. It's like a knife through butter. have to really retreat. You got me. You're getting cocky. You can't get cocky. Looks like my clothes took it though. Yeah. What if my hand's healed? Yes. Some kind of clothes kept me protected. Nothing good? Not really. It's the regular old zombie outfits. Nice looking ranger car there. I only really want vans though, so I can carry everything with me. Because if I start leaving a, my van somewhere, it's like I'm creating a, va a base. Temporary base. Is anybody in here? Doesn't look like it. Alright. So we want wood glue. And thread. Is 
some shit in here, but not all that much. I thought wood glue spawned in this in this place. Maybe they changed it. So I have to go somewhere else, like a hardware store. There you have a needle. Good on thread print by now. Having to go to a hardware store wouldn't be the end of the world. I could just go over to Riverside. Make a proper road trip out of it. Already have a ten. Yeah. No wood glue so far. Maybe the self storage place will have it. Oh, big thing of weapons. Sledgehammer, if I needed one, I don't. I wonder if I have a mold draw map. Yeah, this warehouse is a bust. Alright, let's equip our other bat. Wear that out. Try the self storage place over here. Assuming there aren't a bunch of hostile NPCs in there. Even if there are, maybe I'll fight for it. Maybe not, depending on what they're armed with. Security guard, and he is hostile. We can solve this problem. Follow me, zombies. Uh... 
I got a bunch of zombies. Queued up for me. Pills. All right, let's go down. Well, let's find a better position first. Man, they are really piling in here. Blocking us a little bit. A little bit of snow meltage, I guess it's above freezing. to sleep through the night. If I was the one that killed 1600 zombies by hand, probably would have nightmares too. Get some rest. Take a breather. Let's 
weird how that model doesn't quite line up. Still following me? Yep. So you can't camp on fences anymore, but you can still wait for them to jump over and then move up. chair in here. Looks like there is. Not in here though. Take a breather. Or don't. That's pretty long range. Rest. Not exactly a safe place to be resting, but maybe I'll be able to get rid of this exertion malice before I get back out there. Tired, tired. So far, so good. Haven't been interrupted yet. be soon. Get as much rest out of this as I can. Take near a while to break through that window. I'm fully rested. Nice. Yeah, that tiredness now is brutal. It wasn't the exertion that was doing it, it's the tiredness. Now they're kind of swarming around my van. I have to spend the night here. Yeah, this guy. Unless I can clear these zombies away. Then. Green, red, yellow. Oh, I beat the shit out of this jacket. It's no good anymore. Oh, I 
Yeah, fight again. One of these guys was a security guard. This one in that pile. Should have something on the ground to indicate. Yeah. a pistol on the ground here. What kind of pistol is it? 9mm? Doesn't have a mag. He's almost out of ammo. Is there anything in this bag? Nope. I forget where the two-story houses in Muldra are. I think they're over here, actually. Alright, I gotta be more cautious now that I'm tired. Parking right next to a house with a house alarm. Always bad news bears. Peeling off pretty good, one by one. Still just normal tired. It again. Oh, we're almost done here. Take these two out manually. Eventually. That was excellent timing. <laughs> My bat breaks for the last two zombies to get into my van. Quartered, got 
fifth of a point. Let's see, I'm a little too tired to go to Riverside today. find somewhere to spend the night here at Muldra. Get it cleared. Take a nap. Those look like two-story houses. That's one of them. Where are all these zombies going? Did my engine noise attracted them? Now that I'm tired. I could spend a little bit of time looting these houses, see if they got canned vegetables. So I need to be on a diet. This guy's getting fat. I have to do carpentry before I can really do a spear. So you need carpentry to make them. Oh, there's another big old group over there. Ah, oh, and another alarm went off over here. Who left this door open? me. Alright, now the food's actually starting to look like it's... extremely rare. fight all these zombies, I'm too tired. There's a lot of them. Fuck them out of them. Let's get back to the van, find a different spot. There's too many zombies here. Church. I can't sleep in the church because there's no bed. 
Yeah, why are they all migrating? Another house alarm. Survivor house. Yeah, this is where we're gonna spend the night. Hopefully too many zombies don't come pouring out of the woods there. the snow, I guess it's warm out, yeah, it's 40 degrees. <laughs> Worst case scenario, I could just park my car right next to the... the wall there. Sleep in the car. So it would be invulnerable. I see one coming through there. and get in. this window. Let's eat up. It's getting hungry. Should be the last of my vegetable stir fry. No, it's not. Why can't you climb through? Houston, we have a safe house. This window is a little bit more important to the barricade. It'll take them a little while to get through the door. Just top off my water. It's a little early to be going to bed, but this guy can just not sleep. Oh, what's wrong with him? But let's check out what we got in the survivor house. Another DE pistol, a bunch of ammo. Another baseball bat. 
running low on baseball bats now that I don't. Um, don't have any wood glue to fix them with. That's the whole point of coming here. Got a little sidetracked though. large number of zombies around which isn't the worst thing you know, I need zombies to train my skills sometimes even even this guy even Willie Thompson can be overwhelmed nothing man as far as survivor houses go, this one kind of sucks. Do I want to barricade myself in yet? Not even less snow. Looks like I'm gonna have to. Oh, there's a food market right there. I do need some food. Let's see if I can get to it. See how many zombies there are. Before it gets to be sunset. Cause then I can just look around for a grill. Grill up some more vegetable stir fry. I should find a, a roasting pan and make some vegetable roast. There was one back in that Spiffos, but it didn't occur to me to take it. A shitty little store. Real crap. around this fucking stool. Big one. Over there. Grab the mustard. I believe we can use the mustard. Could make some pasta. It's pretty high calorie. On vegetables. Oh well, that was a bust. Let's see if I have a mold draw map in the car. Um, let's not. There's a horde gathering around the car. <laughs> Alright, looks like we're pretty well trapped for tonight. Hopefully they won't try to find me here. Uh, we'll stay in this room. Nails I still got left a whole bunch. Don't have to worry about that for a while. Shit. I hear them trying to break in. Fuck. Yeah, I'm tired. I can't really fight very well. Okay, 
dude, the whole horde isn't coming. But they might after I kill this guy. A lot of noise. Before I forget, let's grab some of these things. It has a mag in it, so let's take the mag out because I need another magazine for my DE pistol. Do I need a second DE pistol actually? It's not that heavy. I could just take my second DE pistol. Alright, pop your mag. into this magazine. Perfect. Yeah, I can hear them outside. Makes me a little bit nervous. I don't think they know I'm in here. Alright, let's try this again. Shades on all the windows, so they can't see me. Sweet. Well, we've survived another day. Pretty eventful. Lots of zombies, moved to a new town. I'm gonna move to another new town tomorrow. I gotta go to Riverside and check out their uh, their hardware store. Try to get some more wood glue. Really need wood glue. So wasn't successful in finding any today, but maybe tomorrow we'll bring us more luck. All right, everyone, have a wonderful day. Peace.